Hey everyone, welcome to this daily Sidereal Astrology Forecast. This is for Wednesday, February 27th, 2019. All right, so today we have the moon in a fucus, so the theme likely today around healing. Now this can be healing of our physical bodies, but also healing spiritually, um, emotionally, psychologically, um, whatever it might be on that internal level as well. So with this theme, we're still kind of in the continuation of the energies from this early part of the week. We have Venus now lifting up off of that conjunction with the South Node. So a great day for maybe implementing a fresh new start with our values, our enjoyments, or maybe relationship um, life from maybe any, any releasing from the past couple days there. Um, Mercury sextiling that, so still good to be enjoying some communication, maybe some learning. And um, today the Sun is going to sextile Mars exact, so... Although just an opening, it's a great day for maybe a bit of directness and assertiveness and just noticing a bit of maybe direct self-expression. All right, so let's take a look at all of this here in more detail when we return. All right, so here's the sky for this Wednesday. So again, we are using the actual size of the constellations and the actual um, constellations that aren't normally used in mainstream astrology. For example, a Fucus is a constellation that does pass through the ecliptic here. So um, if you are new to the channel, definitely check out the link down below for more information on true sidereal astrology. All right, so the moon shifting from Scorpio into a Fucus here today. Although very similar energies, because as you can see here, they do share the same part of the sky. But uh, a fucus kind of takes that deeper energy of Scorpio one step further, and it makes it great for essentially healing and acceptance work, right? And if you think of what healing really is, I mean, it's really about becoming aware of some aspect of ourself or of life that once we accept, right, once we become aware of it and then accept, accept it, and then take it another step forward and work with it, it becomes healing, right? It becomes therapeutic, it becomes transformative. And so it's a great day here for becoming aware of, accepting and working with the deeper aspects of the human experience. Um, and in this process, yes, maybe feeling a bit rejuvenated, redeemed, holistic, and uh, transformed perhaps, especially um, once we get into the later part of the day, the moon is gonna pass over the galactic center which is right here at the end of a fucus. And um, then the next uh, few days will be more on the post-transformation energy of Sagittarius, which is more on that uh, sort of free-spirited or at least more broadened perspective, kind of like the butterfly out of the cocoon. All right, so, um, so that's the backdrop to the day in terms of the aspects. Uh, again, still very much like the past few days. Uh, Venus is now fully away from that conjunction with the south node. So if there was any releasing that took place earlier in the week regarding your values, um, your, maybe your enjoyments in life or relationship stuff, um, this is a sort of fresh new start here. So maybe a bit of freshness today, clean slate with some of those things with Venus uh, moving away from the south node. And uh, Mercury's been sextiling Venus. So although minor, there could be this uh, good day for enjoying some communication, maybe some learning. This can be reading, writing, um, even trade and exchanging with others. Anything on this kind of flexible, adaptive, and willing to exchange and learn kind of energy, just supportive here with this sextile. Now, probably the most important thing today, although it's not a major aspect, the sun is going to be sextiling Mars exact. So uh, with this, there could be a bit of directness and particularly with our self-expression. So we could just notice this. It's a good day to do this kind of stuff. If you feel like there's anything you can express, or maybe you want to do creatively or something you're focused on that you can put a bit of this assertive, direct energy into or maybe even, even initiate some things, right? Really good uh, time for maybe doing something that's active or initiating based on what we're focused on. So a bit of an opening here today for that, and um, that's gonna be taking us into tomorrow as well. All right, everyone, so that's the most important stuff, and then the moon is gonna pass over Jupiter, who's already been transiting a fucus, so there could be some insight today, even though it is a deeper <clears throat> type of energy with a fucus, 
Jupiter does tend to lift things up a bit buoyantly. Helps us see, the, again, the broader perspective, just like that Sagittarius, a broadened perspective, maybe helps us see opportunities, again, in the healing or transformative department. Even breaking some cycles and patterns can be great. And uh, yeah, just some insight that can come in regarding this stuff. So opportunities, wisdom, insights, maybe feeling a bit buoyant or open-minded. Uh, while we're going through this uh, sort of, again, cocoon of this transformation process. All right, everyone. So, yep, that's the day in a nutshell. Hope you all have a fantastic day. <clears throat> Thank you for watching. And I will see you all tomorrow for the daily forecast. Take care.